The late shift at the abandoned amusement park was always eerie, but tonight was different. Jake, a curious teenager looking for some summer cash, found himself drawn to an old, dilapidated ride that had long been forgotten. As he wandered through the rusted attractions, a chill ran down his spine. His flashlight flickered, casting long shadows on the decaying carnival games. Against his better judgment, Jake followed a creaking sound, leading him to a hidden door behind the carousel. With trepidation, he pushed the door open and entered a narrow passage. The air grew thick as he stumbled upon a room, dimly lit by a single dangling bulb. In the center, a lifeless body lay, its eyes staring into the void. The sight sent shivers down Jake's spine. As he fumbled for his phone to call the police, a sudden whisper echoed through the hidden room. You shouldn't have come here, it hissed. Panicking, Jake turned, only to find the door had sealed shut behind him. The walls seemed to close in, suffocating him with a malevolent force. Footsteps echoed in the darkness, and Jake's heart pounded. He raced to the door, pounding on it in desperation. The whispers grew louder, taunting him with sinister secrets. Just as he thought he was losing his mind, the door creaked open. Relieved, Jake stumbled into the dimly lit corridors of the park. But the sense of being watched persisted. Shadows danced in his peripheral vision, and the air grew colder with every step. The park, once a place of joy, now exuded an ominous energy. As he approached the park's exit, a hooded figure emerged from the shadows. You've seen too much, it rasped, lunging at Jake. Fear propelled him into a desperate run through the deserted park. The hooded figure pursued, its presence an ever-looming threat. Jake's lungs burned as he reached the park's gate. He fumbled with the lock, glancing back to see the figure closing in. With the gate finally open, he burst onto the desolate street, hoping to outrun the relentless stalker. But the nightmare wasn't over. In a dim alley, the figure cornered him. Panic surged as it revealed a gleaming knife. You can't escape, it whispered. Just as the blade descended, a distant siren wailed. The figure vanished, leaving Jake shaken and alone. Gasping for breath, he stumbled to the nearest police station. As he reported the gruesome discovery in the terrifying ordeal, the police descended upon the abandoned amusement park. The hidden room revealed a history of dark rituals, and the lifeless body turned out to be a victim of a twisted past. The park, once a beacon of laughter, now stood as a haunted monument to unspeakable horrors. Jake, scarred by the night's events, would forever carry the weight of the shadows that lurked in the forgotten corners of the amusement park. The chilling whispers and the hooded figure became a haunting memory, a tale whispered by those who dared to venture into the realm of the abandoned.